I think uh, you know we got a, we got a lot of centers at camp and and you know fighting for spots and I think competition is the most important thing. Um, you know Holly did a great job for us when when he was with us last year and then obviously Santarelli is a great player and you know Contiola has come over here and, and he's a great player. So I mean we got lots of options. Obviously losing Bowen's tough. He's a great leader and a great player uh, that knows how to win. But uh, I think we got guys that can step in and fill that role for sure. You're confident that Nas can take a step forward as well. Yeah, absolutely. I think Nas is an unbelievable player. I think uh, I think he gets a little too much. Uh, I don't know what to say, but uh, you know he gets a, a lot of flack from from people. But I mean, he he's put together a, a couple really good years as as a young player, and uh, it's not easy to play in Toronto. We're coming in as a first round draft pick, and uh, you know expectations are high. And I think he's done an unbelievable job, and uh, he's only going to get better. Carly, can you compare the skill set of the, the wingers you usually play with to a Joffrey Lupo and how they compare? Yeah, I mean, I, I played with Joffrey uh, the whole year pretty much two years ago. So I think, uh, you know, he, he fills in every now and again last year too. So um, obviously used to playing with him. I don't think that'll be too different. He's an unbelievable player. And then, you know, Levo's had a great camp and, uh, you know, he's also a great player. So, I mean, I'm, I'm always lucky enough to play with great wingers that make it a lot easier on me. How much different is it for you to get a chance uh, to start a camp to kind of watch the guys from the stands opposed to being on the ice and get an idea of some of the young guys that have made an impact? Uh, I mean, I'd rather be out there for sure. But, uh, yeah, I guess, I mean, it's tough to watch the games. You wait all summer and you want to you wanna play in the games and you want to get your timing back and get ready for the season. So that part's tough. But, it's uh, you know, it's cool to see a lot of these young guys, uh, you know, coming in that I haven't seen before. And it's crazy the, the skill set that a lot of these young kids have now and the hands that they develop uh, at a young age. So it's fun to watch. Given Randy was sort of using what last week about splitting up you guys with JBR, how are you looking at it? Are you expecting the status quo to prevail in the end, or are you prepared to? I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I have no idea what's going to happen. We still got a ways away till opening night, so obviously those decisions will be made when when the time comes. But uh, I mean, uh, we had a lot of success at last year as a line, so I mean, I'm not sure what they're going to do. But uh, I mean, I'll play with whoever I'm I'm put with.